So, hello friends of Paolo Sigmeier's Knife Works. Um, today we look at play number four, and as always, Inga and me will do the whole play again, uh, the whole play um, before from both sides, so you can see what it's all about, and then we talk about it. Okay, <coughs> let's begin. One, two. <coughs> Three, four, five, <clears throat> six. <clears throat> Seven. Okay, so um, what do we do here? Um, in the beginning, we have two inward binds. And so with the lesson of what we did the last time, we thought, how can we get there? And um, we begin again with, uh, with me attacking Inga. With me attacking Inga um, to her uh, to her right side, so I step forward and attack her to the neck. Um, she doesn't like that, and she retreats and uh, and makes an uppercut as in the last time. So up. and um, she's out of reach, and she got me. Um, so now. I could anticipate that she's doing that and put my dagger on the arm for parrying that. Um, in the moment when she, uh, when she cuts there, um, I, have, I can take her arm. So, uh, give her my arm. So, I parry here. Yeah, she doesn't hurt me. That's cool. But she's going through with the dagger and I have my hand already here. It's moving forward, pressing her elbow, going to the head or the neck. Whatever you like, you have targets in um, But now we come again to the point where she anticipates that I anticipate what we will be doing, and so we come into the spine. <clears throat> so I attack, up, and we come into the spine. So from here, he says um, we should work in this. So, which means, hmm. I would react before I come even into the spine and wind below and step to her arm. Okay, so just wind below and go to her arm. I can, from, from here, if I, my knife is through her arm, I can do 
things, yeah, I can work here. Um, <coughs> that's, um, yeah, possible. So, um, but she doesn't like the command to follow in the medicine. She doesn't like that, and from here you can uh, make an interesting um, uh, isolation exercise again. <coughs> so, begin in the bind. I want to step here, but she parries me down with the dagger on her arm and steps to my uh, steps to my head. But I can parry that with my dagger here, and that's like like overbinding when you work with a sword. And she takes this motion and goes uh, goes to the target below. And I can block this here again. So do this again. So you can do this as um, as an exercise. Hop, top, top, top. Again, hop, hop, hop. Okay. Once again, just just to see. So, so it's pretty pretty interesting. It looks like a little bit like kung fu. So hop, hop, hop. hop. Okay. From here. <coughs> <laughs> so, from here, I take her dagger, and there are two possibilities now. I can grab it like this, or I can grab it like this. So both things work. Show you first um, possible what I showed before. So I grab it like this, and now I turn around her arm here. If she doesn't leave it, I have her in in this grip, and now I, I can work on her neck. Um, that's one possibility. And the other possibility uh, would be like, so, <coughs> would be like gripping it from below, and from here, I have my I have my uh, my dagger still <coughs> here on this on this uh, on this pressure point. This this hurts very much if you press on that, and I can I can press it here, and then and can do things. So, but she doesn't like that, and. Um, <coughs> In the moment when she realizes I'm, that her dagger is stuck and I have her dagger, she lets it go. So, so parry that here, grab for the dagger, I want to wind her around, and now she grabs on my hand. And then she pushes with the other hand against my elbow, makes a step inward, and when you want to take someone in this kind of police grip, you have to bring them to the ground. Otherwise, they can. Why not? And, and that's what she do, she's doing. Drück mal, kannst du? Yeah. So uh, <laughs> you have to you have to bring people on the ground if you use this kind this kind of, of hook. Um, willst du das andere noch mal mit dem mit dem hinten durchmachen zeigen? Okay. So there, there's another possibility. Um, zeigen wir mal von der Seite vielleicht. Kann man das, ich, so. Okay, the other possibility, um, grab from here, I want to do that, so she leaves me, uh, yeah. Yeah. so um, I, don't, I don't grab the, the hand from below, but I grab the hand from above and um, control the elbow and then I bend his arm around to the back and here I change quickly my grip the left arm to the hand and I go with the right hand through so I can use the leather with my outstretched arm to bring him down and then I push with my knee <laughs> to get him completely under control. Yeah. So, and um, so the last part is not exactly what Maya probably meant to do. I think he uh, was more, and his what he described in was more the intention of the first thing we did. But the second one also works. Okay, and um, I think that's it for today. Um, if you want to discuss that with us, um, please feel free and um, comment below. And yeah, well, thank you, Inga. Thank you. And thank you for watching. <laughs>